Welcome to an unboxing of the Intel Core i5-357 processor. So this processor is an Ivy Bridge processor. It's not unlocked and I'm pretty sure it runs at 3.4 GHz. I'll have to check that out. Honestly, I'm not quite sure. So, the box opens up on the side like so. And then, just a brown bag we pull out. So there's nothing else in there, except for the manual, which I did take out before. Now, let's concentrate on the heatsink, which is what we first presented with. The processor is up just on the top there. So there's a little plastic cover that holds the heatsink on. Take that off. And then, try not to touch this little copper bit here, because that's where the thermal paste is pre-applied to the stock Intel heatsink and we're just going to take the side here and lift this off. Now this of course is the stock fan and uh, it's it's okay for I mean general computing if it's just web browsing and you don't need anything else but I've got a uh, Antec cooler to go in there so just yeah just the Intel stock cooler with some pre-applied thermal paste and that sticks onto your motherboard with four pins. So hold on if I sit that down there for a second and if I loosen that up. It just sits in kinda like so. So it just pushes in with the four pins that lock it in. And that's it for the manual here. Until Core i5 processor. Um, there is a, there's a bit of tape covering that off. Um, I'll just remove that bit of tape. Give me a second. There we go. So just basically like basic like instructions on how to install it. There you go with the push pull and how to insert the install the processor with that little latch there. And on the back we have the Intel sticker, so that's all good. So that's basically it for the processor. Um, if you haven't looked at my other videos on the Ultimate Server, which is what I'm pretty much building here, um, just a file server really, not for gaming or anything, but in the background there I've got a, I've got four Western Digital red NAS grade hard drives, so they're going to be all going in the, into this uh, beastly little machine here all fitting into the Fractal Design Node 304. So if you enjoyed this quick little unboxing of the Intel heatsink and the processor, oh, I'll get the processor out. I mean, it just sits in there really and then you pull it out like so, being very careful not to break it of course. And then on the back, I won't get it out just yet because I'm not ready to put it in. We have the 1,155 pins, and that of course lines up pretty specially with the motherboard. So thank you again for watching. If you enjoyed this video, I do encourage you to subscribe and check out my other videos. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have a good day.